Hi, this is Sailor the Piper, man. I'm trying this Cela V, Dominican blend, totally Dominican blend. I believe it has a Connecticut shade wrapper. So far, so good. My first draw, decent draw. Uh, has some coffee, nutty, very light mild. A lot like um, um, a mac well aged maca noodle. It seems to be well cured, well aged. Um, I'm not getting any bitterness out of it. The, the construction is pretty decent. It's got gray ashes. Surprise! This is the first time I ever tried this. And uh, it's going to go well with my coffee, man. Not bad. And I, I just bought the Cela V. Uh, courtesy of, of a friend that says well you like something mild once in a while early in the morning try this one so far construction's holding up and i realized in bundle cigars you're better buying a robusto size uh corona and lonsdale size and churchill and, and bigger size and so far so good look at this excellent draw nice aftertaste i'm tasting tobacco i'm not tasting any additives on it and that's what i want cigar that tastes like tobacco that it's going to give me a nice draw in the beginning it's going to have a good taste in this it's getting buttery <laughs> you know like um Nasty. They used to be a, a, a cigar I used to smoke called Don Tomas. The Don Tomas was well aged, but it was Honduran, I think, or Nicaragua. But this one, Dominican blend, it's pretty good. Cela V, sold by uh, Pipes and Cigars. It's a sleeper. Nice, nice entry. For my first time, I bought a bundle, two bundles. And I'm going to enjoy them. <laughs> hey, guys, thank you for you guys hooking me up with fac uh, the factory blend. And uh, I'm going to try one later on. I'll let you know what that's like.